Hey everyone. Now you've probably seen lately, I've been playing with my new toy, the BYD Seal. And one of the things I wanna do, which I believe can be done, is install a third party application on there because it's just an Android system. So what I'm gonna do is set up this USB stick and try and put the BOM app on there and see how that goes. Now for those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, BOM is the Bureau of Meteorology. So it's basically the rain radars. That's what a lot of people use. And here's the webpage for it in HTTP, not HTTPS, because our government's just awesome. But anyway, there's an app for that, and that's what I want to try and put on the car. So I found some stuff online, says you just got to put FAT32, which is what I noticed with music too. I had an X4 file system that I previously used in the Tesla, but it wouldn't read it in the BYD, so I had to make it FAT32. So anyway, I'll format this to FAT32, and put a directory on there for third-party apps, and see if I can load it. So I just plug that thing in, and run GPART it. See what happens. Okay, let's have a look here. That's my normal drive. And here's a little memory stick. Now, I haven't got any partitions on there at the moment, so I'll just set one up. Not X4, as I just said. We'll make it FAT32. And get into it. Okay, that's done. So that's that. I'll piss that off. And just for stamps, I'll unplug it and plug it back in, so that's all fresh. Okay, so on that, media, blah, blah, blah. That's the... That's the petition I just made. Now I've got to make a directory called third party apps, apparently. So that's there. So I've got a hold of this APK file, which is the Android image for Bomb Weber from APK Pure, and I'm just going to put it in that directory. So CP bomb to here. It's pretty big, it's like a hundred and something meg. Fucking hell, come on. Okay, so I'll unmount that. Boom boom boom. Busy because I'm in that directory. Do that again. Okay, now I'll go plug this in the car and see what happens. All right, I'm in the car and I've just turned it on. And I'm about to plug this thing. Oh, fucking noise, I've got to go. <laughs> the car's on. Um, I'm going to plug this thing in and see what happens. Okay, so under here, plug the fucking thing in. Let's see what happens to my screen. Okay, comes up for a password. Now, I found a password somewhere online and it says it's this. GHY0613BYD. Let's have a go, shall we? G H Y zero six one three B Y D. Okay, so there's the file I put on there. So I'll press that and press install. I'll probably move back a bit here. So that was over 100 megs, so that might take a little minute. We'll see. Was that tick there a second ago? I don't know, can't remember. Let's have a look. I'll go back here, or go to the home bit. Go along to where the apps and stuff are. Oh, look at this! Bomb weather! Fuck me dead. Something's here. Some standard crap. Accept that. Of course I do. Uh, location. I'll search for location rather than use the current one. Uh, Brisbane. Brisbane Airport, that will do. Holy shit, here we go, this is looking good. Alright, there we go, there's a weather forecast. Let's have a look for rain. There it is. There you go, I've got the bomb bloody app on the car. Don't worry about the fact that the dashboard's missing. I've been through that, that's a work in progress. And uh, you all know the story with that. So anyway, that's how you put an app on the BYD, apparently, and there it is. Okay, so I just turned the cellular off and restarted the app. So it would have made its initial connection now through Wi-Fi, which I would have thought it had done anyway before. But anyway, it's on there now. So you can see, so you've got some motion and it's working. Okay, so that was pretty quick and easy. I don't know where that password came from, how they actually found that out to release it, but um, it took me two seconds to find, but where it originated, I don't know. But anyway, that's on there, and I've got to say, I've been having a bit of fun with this car. It's, it's certainly good to tinker around with, so I do like it. Anyway, that's it for now. Until next time, take it easy.